I'm John Larson, Technical Trainer for EpiRock USA Surface and Exploration Drilling. Today we're going to talk about how to troubleshoot a no flushing air situation on a FlexiRock D65. This will also apply to the FlexiRock D60 DTH machines. The problem we encounter is when we start up in the morning, we'll have feed going up and down, but we will not have flushing air, thus creating a no impact situation for drilling. The problem usually lies in the proximity switches located with the rod handling system. It means that either after transport or overnight they have drifted out slightly so the machine thinks that the rod handling arms are out into the drill center position and it doesn't want to let you make contact cradle to the rod handling arms. The simple solution for this is to simply put it in drill mode as you probably already are. The rod transfer arms push them back to the carousel position using the rod handling controls on the left hand side of the chair. At this point we should now have flushing air. If you don't have flushing air after this happens we need further diagnostics to verify the proximity switches are working or any other variables that you may encounter with the machine. If you need further assistance with this please contact your local EpiRock service center or the dealer in your area.